Hi Leo, welcome to All Is Mine Tarot. So today we're going to be doing your timeless general energy check-in. Hopefully y'all are doing amazing. Thank you so much for stopping by. And let's go ahead and dive right in. Spirit, what do we have for our lovely Leos? Please and thank you. You know what? I'm not taking these because I feel like these same cards that came out in the last pile and these have been shuffled extremely well you know what I mean I mean unless you're connected to a Virgo then it would make sense Spirit what do we have for our lovely Leo please and thank you What do we got? Well, I just saw one, one, one on the clock. Timing. Love. Get one more. For Leo, please and thank you. Ooh, we got two more. We got transformation. Scorpionic energy. And then we have rejection. At the bottom of the deck, we have peace. Some of you have been feeling a lot of peaceful energy. We have surprise, tunnel vision, and peace at the bottom of the deck. I feel like a lot of you are focused on your goals and yourself and what you need, right? I feel like a lot of you, if you're single, I feel like there's going to be a new partner coming into your life at the right time. And I feel like, I feel like you're able to feel this mega transformation you've recently been through, right? And we have rejection here. This could be connected to an old lover or something that you just don't like. And that's how you know you've transformed because you were able to reject whatever this is. Now let's go ahead and dive into the tarot here and see what we got. <clears throat> Spirit, what do we have for timing for our lovely lions here? What is this timing card? We got the page, queen of pentacles. Not page, we got the queen. What is this timing card for Leo? Please and thank you. Eight of Cups. Got one more for this timing card. And the Hermit. I feel like a lot of you are in a very abundant, stable energy right now, very grounded. I feel like, I feel like either you walked away from somebody or somebody walked away from you, but whatever the case may be here, it's like you went through this dark night in the soul. You wised up, you healed the things and the parts of you that were dark you know you took a good look at it and you i feel like you put a lot of love into whatever it was that you were unsure of right <clears throat> it does feel like a lot of you are alone right now but being alone isn't always a bad thing like you're able to really discover yourself right that's why the hermit goes alone um that's why he goes introverted so he can you know really dive deep and i feel like with this timing card here of the hanged man like 
some of you might be waiting for something to come in but i wouldn't suggest waiting i know you're probably not it's like you're focusing on like your bag and like what inspires you here what direction you want to take your life but there is something with this timing card here what is this love card for our lovely leos please and thank you we have the lovers and the tower feels like again with this eight of cups card right next to it it does feel like there was something that literally blew up some sort of a deep bond disconnected here because it was faulty Oof, there could have been third party energy it doesn't have to be here but I do see you here in the Three of Wands transferring that Three of Swords into a Three of Wands into Source energy, Sun energy here, like healed energy. Like, feels like this is um, an energy of the past. Can I have one more card for this love card? Yeah, it's like. Some of you had a gut feeling about whatever this ending is or was. And I feel like you listened to your guidance here and you let that shit go. Because we're not gonna keep something around if it doesn't wanna be there, right? Let that shit go yeah it's like you you tuned into your emotions and you figured out what was best for you wow we have underneath that we got strength and the seven of swords with the six of swords it's like you were done lying to yourself about what it was and you moved the hell on Props, props, because that's not easy. A lot of people will stay in shitty situations just because it's easy, because it's comfortable. So kudos to you, Leo, for reals. All right, what is this transformation card? This is like Pluto energy, tower energy, judgment energy, right? What is this? transformation we have the five of cups and there's the three of wands with the ten of cups here yeah a lot of you it's like you channeled <clears throat> this sadness and grief into a brighter future for you into things that were more positive, into things that you wanted for yourself. And that's what really led you to this mega transformation. It feels like you're a whole new person, Leo. A whole ass new person. Like, that is no easy feat. Yeah, I feel like a lot of you we're done competing for either someone's attention or affection or you were done competing for you know somebody's love and it was like you let it go i mean under on the top of the deck we have the nine of swords five of pentacles two of wands and the four of pentacles it didn't come easy. It feels like you literally went through hell and back. But you made the choice to release these blockages that you held on to, right? And you were done. What is this rejection card for Leo? Two of Pentacles, the star. We got 
have the two of pentacles, the star, the four of swords, and the ten of swords. Yeah, you did the inner work here. And that's why you don't have time for things that feel petty, less than things that don't feel in alignment with you. That shit's coming nowhere the fuck near you, right? You did the work. And that's why you're able to reject what this, you know, whatever, like the things that feel like fake to you or you know it's like you got your truth your clarity here you received your breakthrough and it's almost like you wrapped up a major cycle here that felt really heavy huge yeah it's like some of you do have somebody from your past maybe it was this person that you you know things broke off with but this person is watching you this person still loves you and wants to move forward with you and they're watching you move the hell on without them and for some reason they thought for some reason they thought that you were going to come crawling back but nope now let's get some outcome cards here the page of swords outcome oh my gosh the six of cups we just seen these right oh my god there's somebody from your past here who literally is going to keep spying on you and going to keep trying to get things back together with you because they are finally realizing what they're missing out on but you're done just know that this person is not going to stop trying and it's like you remember you remember the way they treated you and how they made you feel. And that's your motivation to continue to reject them, right? Can we get some advice for our lovely Leos? Please and thank you. Yeah, this is too much. I'm going to take only the first batch. But we do have temperance, six of wands, the world, the five of pentacles, nine of swords, and the queen of swords. So first and foremost, spirit wants you to never give up, okay? Like even when times get dark for you or stressful. Continue to focus on your journey here. You have learned your lessons here. Focus on the things that um, make you feel good here. Continue to focus on mastering your crafts and these things that you are working on. And these were the first, the first three initial cards that came out and then out popped the second, but we got the Knight of Swords, the Magician, and the Ace of Wands. Continue pursuing your passions is basically the same thing, showing up in a different form. Um, some of you might be starting a new project here, a new business, whatever this new endeavor is, like, get excited about it. Get excited about it, get passionate about it, and I feel like it's going to really help unlock new paths for you. There's going to be new collaborations coming in. Yeah new blessings, new offers, and this is all connected to like your fantasies and your dreams. Yeah, like you just saw the four of wands. You're going to achieve a lot of success in your life, Leo, so get ready. Alrighty, my loves, well, thank you so much. Hopefully you enjoyed your reading. Thank you so much for stopping by, and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace out, Leo.